do that? Okay, excellent. Um, does anyone know who the author behind the town newsletter is? Glad you brought that up. No. Okay. But we need to. I agree. Um, I'm glad that I wrote this down because I'm so tired of it. I know, I forgot two things. Um, I've asked, I haven't heard anything, but simply telling people that it is a volunteer, is, it's, it bothers me. Uh, it was a volunteer background check. It was, were they background check as for the town code? We don't know. Why is the volunteer involved in government business? And why is, the, why is there secrecy behind their identity? I uh, would like for this governing body to uh, pass a resolution requiring the mayor to tell us who this volunteer is, disclose who this volunteer is. It's not a town, it, it, it comes off as a town publication. And it's, it's without a doubt politically slanted and factually incorrect on many levels. Um, with what appears to be the norm in the dissemination of confidential information, uh, I believe that the governing body should have the opportunity to review it before it's released. It's not a town publication, as I've said, but if the mayor's office continues to represent it as if it were, we should at least have the opportunity to review it. Um, and if this behavior does persist, I would request that the town attorney investigate the publication and its content pertaining to our code of ethics. Can we pass resolutions? I just emailed them. Oh, this is a, a what? This is a website that's put on the town. Uh, yeah. Town? It's an opt-in through the town website, which makes it town property. What is an opt-in? Um, did you see the the? It is the newsletter that was put out that. Uh, I want to join your mail list. Clay. The email blast. Right. The okay. email blast. And it's through the town website. Right. Okay. Which means if a town employee is not the one generating it. I mean, that's politically slant. I mean, it was it was it's a pure political piece. I was trying to understand. The nature of the mailing itself. So it's put out. It's, it's, um, put it's out electronically through. emailed to people that opt in. Okay. From the from the town. From the town website. From the town website. Correct. Yes. Right. Right. But if he wants to rename it to you know his okay. point of view, I'm certainly okay with it's that. Simple. But it can't go through the town website. Okay. All right. But it's is it no. title but the mayor's the like mayor's corner? No. It's called Phillipsburg Riverfront News. No, it says the mayor worked on this, the mayor worked on that, the mayor worked on this. Mm -hmm. The mayor can right, but it's, put out his own. I agree wholeheartedly. But it, 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 it appears to be as if it's a town newsletter. And it's not. Okay. That's if it's, if it's speaking on behalf of the town. Okay. It right. also released the information that was distributed in executive session. Uh oh. So that's wow. a bit of a problem. Hammer time. Ethics charge. Thank you. How about, um, how about recall?